but to come, we will walk you through the resources available if you plan to file an appeal. Before that, let's hear from KSHB 41's Alyssa Jackson following through with the homeowner in Lee Summit about his appeal process. Everybody's mad. Tens of thousands of Jackson County homeowners are in the same boat. It's kind of nonsense to increase those rates so much. Everybody's protesting. Philip Martin is among those fighting his property value assessment that went up by 74%. Houses go up in value. I don't mind assessing on a fair value for the home. Martin reached out to KSHB 41 last week after he got one step closer to fighting his assessment, only to receive this in an email. I got the notice saying that I needed to come in for a hearing and they gave me a date of just a set of convoluted numbers that didn't make any sense at all. An issue Martin says was quickly resolved, but only adds to his fear of higher value than he can sell his home for and the unknown as he prepares for a hearing to justify what he believes is a fair amount. That's a frustrating thing. I can bring in all the paperwork in the world and show, hey, these are, this is what the homes in my area have been valued at. And they may go, yeah, that's not enough. Since this isn't his first go around with the Jackson County Assessor's Office, he thinks it's less of a people problem and more of a technology problem that could have been resolved early on. I think they're trying to be very fair about it. But they're using a system. So, I mean, it's systematic. It's everybody's getting hit with these extraordinary bumps. Maybe, he says, that will be the one solution to this fallout so many people aren't in the same position next time. Scrap it soon. They need to get rid of it. Or if they can, tweak it. In Lee Summit, Alyssa Jackson, KSHB 41 News.